Hey guys, welcome to the video. So I thought I would put this together for anyone who had or is experiencing similar um, issues to what I had. So a bit of background, I bought my G502 awesome gaming mouse. Um, super excited to play with it. I plugged it straight into the laptop. Um, I then realized that afterwards I could download the G-Hub suite and configure it. So I did that and at first it discovered the mouse perfectly. Um, but then I found that if I shut the laptop down or put it into rest or restart it, it wouldn't rediscover the mouse. No matter how many times I unplugged it, replugged it, it wouldn't discover it. So I uninstalled the G Hub, reinstalled it, and that worked. So that then redetected it. But as soon as I shut down, lo and behold, it um, lost the mouse and all the settings that I'd configured. So I plugged in my C920 um, and that showed up perfectly every time. So I figured it was the mouse. So I logged a support call with Logitech and they came back with a series of quite complex instructions including backing up G-Hub um, and in the main they were useful but what I'm going to show you is actually what I did um, and that seems to have fixed the problem. So what I needed to do was I needed to Bring up device manager. Now, just wait for that to pop up. Now, Logitech were right in what they said so far. So you need to go to view then devices by container and you'll see the hero mouse here so you pop that open now what they said was click on um, the mouse right click and uninstall device I did that but it didn't work what you need to do is go properties and then driver and then uninstall device. Now I'm not going to do that because they will uninstall the um, the mouse. So I did that. Um, that completely wiped out the the drivers. So then, once the mouse was disabled, I also um, uninstalled G Hub. Um, did a complete restart or shutdown. I then re-downloaded G-Hub and this is really important. Do not um, plug your mouse in until G-Hub has fully downloaded. Once it's downloaded and you're ready to go, then re-plug the mouse in and you'll see that it will uh, download the drivers, giving you everything that you need in order to uh, manage the mouse. Now, I've done that. Um, I've restarted and um, uh, shut down several times, reopened, and every time it's now discovered the mouse, even if I unplug it, replug it. So, Hopefully that's been helpful. Um, if you do get the same issues, I would definitely 
run through that. Um, clearly, if that doesn't work, then um, get on to Logi. But um, that's the fix as I found it. So I hope that's been useful. Um, you know, share, comment, like the vid, and um, if I discover any more tips, I'll be sure to share.